what do I do? Well, I sew most of the time. I, I, you know, I do take in sewing for, you know, it's, it's not that I need to, but it's just, you know, to keep busy. And I like to cook, and I read, and I do crossword puzzles. I always find something to do. I'm never bored. I like to walk. I had my walk every day. And the first thing I would notice is on my walks, my calf would have a very sharp pain. If I stopped, it would go away, and I'd continue. And I did that for quite a while, and I said, gee, this is strange. I had a, an appointment with uh, my regular doctor, and that day, for some reason or other, I had to go up the stairs. And going up the stairs was, I, I thought I was going to pass out. It was just so, you know, the pain was just so bad. And I told my doctor about it. Well, the minute I told him, he took off my shoe and was trying to, feel, you know, feel the pulse. And this is how it all started. You know, I couldn't walk any any distance without the pain, but, you know, I, I just thought it was, you know, I, I wasn't, you know, that concerned about it until, you know, I had the first surgery, and then I knew that it was, you know, something more than just a, a cramp. Well, you know, at the beginning, Dr. Walsh gave me three options, do nothing, surgery, or do the stem cell program. And it just sounded like something that, oh my goodness, it just sounds so far-fetched. I says, you know, it sounded too complicated. And I just, you know, got it out of my mind completely. And then, you know, you kept hearing more, and I kept hearing more, and I kept reading more about it. There was no other surgery that could have been done. If you can see, I, I have so many scars from, you know, the the number of surgeries that I've had that there wasn't room to put another one in. <laughs> After talking with Dr. Walsh, you know, he, he really in, endorsed it, you know, completely. He says that you'd be surprised, uh, you know, how, what good success we've had with the program. And so I said, well, gee, it's, you know, it's, I, like I said, I had to do something, give it a try. They uh, transfer that, uh, the stem cells into the leg in 20 places. You know, it was three, 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 all the way down the leg, injected. She had uh, done a topical uh, uh, anesthetic on, on the leg, and she wrapped it in, in uh, saran wrap, and you know, you know, it wasn't bad, except when it got to the foot, and that one I winced a bit. But uh, I have a very high pain threshold, so it, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't a hardship for me. Had I chosen not to do anything, I would have lost my foot. And, oh, around the house, I can do anything I, I want, you know, but it's a long distance, and if it's a rapid, uh, rapid walk, that's when I get in trouble. But as long as I can take care of myself, do my shopping, I am very grateful for what I have. I would recommend the clinical trial to anyone it certainly has worked miracles for me. You know, if I could participate in this to, to help someone else, I was very glad to do it. <laughs>